Welcome to BNL Stadium here on the shores of Lake Michigan for the 2016 Professional Marble Association World Invitation. We have great competitors today, so expect some exciting action. First up, from Buffalo, New York, we have Smiley. Why does he smile so much? You might ask his neighbor from Kingstown, Jamaica, Scully. Next, from Whereabouts Unknown, is 80. Definitely don't get behind that guy. From Amsterdam, home of the Blender Foundation, we have Susie. And from, well, I guess everywhere, is Earthy. Finally, from right here in Chicago, is Soupy. Let's see if the hometown advantage pays off. The timer starts when the first marble crosses into the stadium proper. And here we go with Scully in the lead, but only just. It really doesn't matter though, as the first bottleneck, the swirl, is just inside the doors. The racers are jockeying for position with some preferring to push ahead and others choosing to hang back. Susie is through first, which means two things. A, when she hits the flywheel, the trapdoor cycle begins. And second, she will have the longest time on the ground to build up momentum going into the pins. As each passes the flywheel, the traps open more, and we should be getting close to the signal. Scully is safely in his berth, with Soupy right behind, but Smiley is really laggy. There go the lights and sirens, and Smiley is still racing for his berth. Will he make it before the traps open? Does he even mean to? This might actually be a bold move on his part. He's got a lot of momentum going into the pins, and yes, Smiley is in the lead and moving fast through the obstacles. Oh, and what can only be called a major league dick move, Soupy cuts him off. But look, Susie's caught up with the leaders. The best move for the upcoming pipes is ahead for the last one, which Soupy does like a pro. Oh, here comes Scully. He's right in as Susie goes for the first tube, and Smiley smiles. Finally, Adi and Earthy have hit the tubes as well. Now we're in the funnel as the racers time their exit to the first spiral lift ahead. Let's just enjoy the dance. We appear to have our first group through. Up they go and across the gap. Scully is the first to the blocks, with Susie and Soupy close behind. And what a jump! Scully is on to the next lift. Let's see if Soupy or Susie will be joining him. The other three racers are across the gap and entering the blocks. And Smiley does a fine jump. He's got a good line. A hole in one. That'll make the 11 o'clock highlights. Meanwhile, you see the tremendous velocity Spiral Lift 2 here at BNL Stadium puts out. And it appears Susie did not make it through the lift with Soupy and Scully. 
Soupy is the first to the relay, but this is a bottleneck as well. Let's see how he plays it. And Scully enters the relay. Really? Sorry. Scully enters the relay. Our spotters tell us that Susie is through lift 2, but after that spectacular jump off the blocks, Smiley flubbed the exit and has to go round again. Susie enters the relay, Scully is a jump ahead, but Soupy is nearing the next to last exchange. And he jumps early! Another bold move by a veteran racer. We'll see if it works out for him. As Scully and Susie make their way through, our spotters tell us that Earthy and 80 have passed Spiral Lift 2. And meanwhile, Smiley lines up for the next cycle. Excuse me? What? Our spotters tell us that Smiley was out of position in the chute. Haiti and Earthy enter the relay together, but Earthy has a better line. Oh, in fact, she's jumped the bar. Hopefully, we can pull up some footage of that. Meanwhile, Scully is off the relay with an epic launch. Susie is near behind. Thanks, Rick. Soupy is well ahead, entering the first screw lift. Smiley seems to be really falling apart. But oh, he mistimes the entry. Falling apart here, but judging by the expression on his face, he seems to be taking it in stride. Back to Earthy's bar jump, it's not a penalty, but it's not considered cricket either. Scully sticks the landing, and he's in. Regardless, she can't seem to capitalize on the move and ends up just even with 80. Let's see how the other racers fare. Susie is next on the scene. And Susie sticks the landing too and is moving on to the fan. Spotters tell us that Smiley missed another cycle for the spiral lift too. Poor guy. We'll check back if or when he gets to the relay. Soupy is on the fan. Here comes Scully. Meanwhile below, Earthy and 80 are nearing the entrance to the first screw lift. Smiley finally enters the relay. Soupy is in the last leg going down the EM highway. It's a long stretch and word from past competitors is that it's surprisingly enjoyable. The EM field has a comforting, soothing effect which relaxes racers before they reach the hammer. Soupy's lined up to enter the hammer, whose naming will become obvious presently. Scully is getting in line, and the hammer is away. Susie is now approaching the hammer. Scully is playing a little loose. Maybe he's too relaxed. And the gold Susie makes a move and is now in second place. And meanwhile, the gold goes to Soupy. Remember, the hammer is trickier than it looks. Susie is not guaranteed a silver. She still needs to nail the exit. And she does. Susie gets the silver. Scully lines up for launch. And there he goes. Bronze goes to the Jamaican. 
International interest in the sport has really grown and has attracted some great talent like Scully. Now for bragging rights. Earthy and 80 have been neck and neck since the relay, but 80 won the toss and enters the hammer first. Eighty takes a commendable fourth place at this highly competitive event. He'll be celebrating tonight even without a medal. Earthy is in the hammer right behind. As long as she makes the exit, she'll get a fifth place finish. And she does. A bittersweet finish for her. Although she's behind Eighty today, she still leads him on the circuit leaderboard. Finally, Smiley is in the hammer. Given today's performance, I would not be surprised if he misses the exit. Racers get as many tries as they wish, but most choose disqualification after a couple misses, rather than book an embarrassing finish time. And Smiley's out, officially taking 6th place. Okay, stay tuned, we'll be right back with the medal ceremony and Tiffany's interviews with the racers, after a short message from our sponsors. <laughs> 